Hey everyone, Tim Schofield here. And this brand new gym bag just came in the mail today. And I know for sure that the new Samsung Galaxy watch is inside. So we're going to be opening that up, seeing what comes in the box, checking out the brand new watch. Also seeing what else comes inside this bag that Samsung has shipped over. Now I know a lot of you have been asking, uh, these shirts are coming very soon. So stay tuned, wait for a special video and a cool giveaway as well. But anyways, let's go ahead and get started. Check out the brand new Samsung Galaxy Watch. Hey. So let's take a look and see what is in this bag. Opening it on up. And right away, of course, as predicted, the brand new Samsung Galaxy Watch. We'll be opening that up in just a second. Let's see what else comes in the gym bag. So it looks like we have some stress relief, a moisturizing body cream. We have a sleep mask, which will actually come in handy. I don't have one of these. It will come in handy on flights and such uh, when traveling. And also looks like we have a nice Camelback water bottle as well. So uh, all things, I guess, related to your health and things that you can kind of uh, incorporate with the Galaxy Watch. Moving on to what we all came here to see, and that is the new Samsung Galaxy Watch. This is the Black 46 millimeter variant on the side here long battery life auto fitness and wellness tracking 35 plus workouts and swim ready water resistant that's great uh, for if you like to swim like myself now let's go ahead and open up the box right away the watch itself we're going to set that to the side for now and we will continue to see what else comes in this box so looks like we have two sides of goodies on this side Looks like you have your charger, which you can set down and it should uh, start charging your watch. Looks like you have USB type A to micro USB cable to connect to your adapter. Here's a close look at that adapter and it will charge just like so. You just set the watch on and it will start charging if you have it plugged in. Finally, one more thing inside the box on the right side here is of course, your wall adapter, you also have what looks like an extra strap right here. Very interesting that they included that. Uh, it's very nice that they included that, I should say. Just didn't expect that. And then you do have a quick start guide for your watch. Here's a close look at the Galaxy Watch. This is a silicone band, which is flexible, so should be very comfortable, water sweat resistant. Uh, down at the bottom here is actually where those sensors are uh, for your heart rate. All that good stuff. Up at the top here, very, very satisfying twisting dial, sounding and feeling. So it's a very satisfying twist. And of course, you will see that there is a bit of plastic on that display. So if we peel that off and look at the right side, there's a couple buttons. Uh, one, is, the bottom one is the power button, and then this is the back button. You'll see there's some texture to them, different coloring as well. Uh, some nice uh, texture as well to the outside of that dial that I mentioned. And you also have some numbers along the outside. So that's it for the close-up. Let's go ahead and press and hold the power button. Let it boot up. Let's see here, Galaxy Watch right out of the bat. I can actually go ahead and put this on my wrist as well. So let's go ahead and do so. It's going to be very difficult with this camera equipment in front of me, but... Uh, want to go ahead and try and do that. All right, so with a little difficulty, I have everything on, all comfortable on my wrist. Now I will need to grab my, in this case, Galaxy Note 9. It is compatible with Android and iOS. I know a lot of people are going to ask that. Uh, we will go ahead and pair it up with our phone. Now for the sake of this video, I did take off the watch just because it's easier to set up and we will go through the Galaxy wearable app just found in the Play Store or App Store. We will of course need to turn on Bluetooth. All right, so a passkey pops up, our watch is vibrating. They do match, so I'm going to hit check, hit okay, and it will go ahead and connect everything on over. Seems fast enough, setting up your phone. And of course, have to give it some permissions for SMS messages and calendar. So of course it can sync up everything to your watch. Let's go. Now this is a 1.3 inch 360 by 360 super AMOLED display. Uh, it says turn clockwise. So we will do so to get to our widgets. Uh, turn the other way to get back to your watch face. 
Turn again for your notifications. So you'll see here there's uh, some Instagram notifications. This is the back button. We're back home. Here's the home key and of course the power key shows all the apps that we do have. Swipe down, show settings and status info, gives you a bunch of information. Cover with your palm to actually turn the display off and that's it. So it's easy enough, all done, enjoy your watch. I'm gonna swipe down so you can see the status of all of the various things. You can change your brightness level, battery do not disturb. You'll see it's at 69% battery right now. Very excited to try out battery life. Uh, it's saying up to four days worth of battery. So as long as it can get through about two days worth of battery, I will be very happy. Uh, in case I forget to charge it one night, I can just charge it the next night. So within settings, you have watch faces, sound and vibration, display settings, advanced, connections, apps, general battery. So a lot of different settings. I do want to actually go into the advanced settings right now where you can double press the home key and you have the option to use Bixby, um, alarm, barometer, you'll see it actually uh, accessed Bixby when I set it. I can go ahead and hit check to allow it uh, access. Contacts, and here we go. Privacy notice, hit agree. So setting that up and of course double pressing uh, the button will actually get you to uh, Bixby. Bixby, what's the weather like right now? And there you go. Let's you know what the weather's like. Sunny. It's even talking to you as well out of the speaker. I can go ahead and hit back and you can customize that, uh, that double press button with the home button. That will actually activate Bixby as well. You have a wake up gesture, bezel wake up, water lock mode, touch sensitivity, theater mode, good night. So many different settings that I will of course run through in the full review, which will be coming soon. So make sure you do click that subscribe button. So now of course, if I go right, you could go ahead and go to all of these widgets, suggested apps, uh, all of your information with health wise, you can add context, reminders, stress, or you can go all the way to the left and you start to see your notifications over there. So that will show your phone's notifications or you can just go back to this watch face. And speaking of this watch face, really cool. Something I have noticed is that uh, when you listen very carefully, it actually will tick very, very slightly. Now, I don't know if you could hear that. I'm gonna do my best to get you guys to hear it, but it's a very subtle tick, similar to what a real watch would sound like. And of course, going to be doing a lot of workouts, checking our heart rate. So let's go ahead and do a measure. All right, it does give you some vibration feedback when it finishes fairly quick. I wanted to let you guys sit through it so you can kind of see how quick that actually took. 84 beats per minute, which is higher than you, higher than a resting heart rate because I'm not actually resting. I'm making a video. So there we go, I can press the back button to go back. I could twist this dial to go through the widgets, go all the way back home. And that's really about it. Or I could press that bottom right button to just quickly go all the way back home and then go ahead and close it if you would like to. And then if you do tap on the display, uh, you will see nothing is happening. However, I believe in settings, you can change that. Or of course, you could just press the power button here. So that's just about it. Everything I want to show off for the Galaxy Watch. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to click that thumbs up button. And as always, guys, thank you very much for watching.